I fucking love the coroner in every single fucking thing. He's very long. They're order. always great. In everything. Well, only a character can take that kind of job. Yeah. Oh, you crazy character. Oh, man, check out this spleen! Crazy in here. Yeah, one of the one like of the they're fucking spinning it around like those noisemakers. Yeah. One of the fucking coroners <laughs> or autopsy Thanks guys in the Hannibal D TV the show was a kid in the hall. <laughs> sure. It was amazing. It'll be in the report, but I'm assuming you want the details now. Please. Cause of death is strangulation. Correct. Take a look at the samples on the bench. Let's look at it. Here's some gameplay. Yep. Seems like the husband did a Rolento super. Uh, will always work on Cody all the time. Maybe. No. No, they vibrated. Yeah, it's that last one. You're not the fire. Look at that shit. Manipulate. Normal uses for that kind of rope. On boats, mooring lines. Thank you, Rusty. Correct. Although Ray says that they're sometimes used as bell ropes in churches. All right, that's a clue. Do you have to do it more, or are we good? I think you're good. No, I think the third or third one was the correct one. This is just there. Maybe this that that one's super not yeah. on point. It's like uh, when you when you you're an artist and you send you send in fake designs that are terrible because you have a really good one that you know is the right one. Greater libido was Mrs. Muller criminally attacked? No external or internal traces of semen. So thanks, Mal. Everything else comes up, you let us know. Just because he didn't finish, didn't mean he didn't do it. Just funsies for murder. Uh, that might just... okay. We've got to nail this guy. That's just a little extra. Just like we nailed motivator. the Black Dahlia killer. Just like that guy. Alright. Oh, you got a TV phone. Uh, Some guys just clean up the captain's room. So, uh, my folks used to know a guy and uh, the way, he, his job used to be that he was a janitor at a hospital, and he was some. It's, it's, it's a different job to be the guys who clean up the surgical rooms. Biohazards. Because it's for real in there when they're done. Okay. And like he he would tell uh, he would it's tell us good. stories, and it's like you wouldn't believe how many organs you just find lying on the floor. <laughs> when wow, they're done wow. operating on somebody. I think you're good. Uh, the music was still going. Yeah, it's weird. And the vibration is still there, too, so... Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh. You can't, like, turn it into... Get it all out of... Kind of. I mean... Get it all another, the way up there. Another phone, That's as high as it's gonna go. Another yeah. phone prompt opened up. I yeah. did see the phone. So, so maybe you can call about, like, where, like... Uh, about boats. Uh, I took a little walk is. over here, and I didn't see a phone on the desk. That's weird, you're right. That's the there phone, it's right there, we found it. Okay. We're geniuses. Wop Wopsy dops. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps badge 1247. Every time. How could I help, Detective? Are there any messages for me? Yes, Detective. A green 1946 coupe. You know the lady talking is wearing those, like, old lady Kamina glasses? Oh, yeah. Yeah. The hair is all done up. Well, every woman in this fucking game's hair is done up. Thanks. Uh, if any woman let down their hair in this time frame of the United States, they'd often be brought straight to jail. All right, Wolves. Uh, there's, a. Uh, there is more evidence in there. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, it's next to the rope. Uh, that's the yeah. There, there was a second vibration. You're right. Some shit. There it is. It's the cats shoe, of the shoes. Shoe now look at them mates. Them big yep. old big old gators. Yep. Those are shoe Tap on marks. It. Yep. Yeah. Pop pop. Yep. The shoe prints. Size eights. Very similar to the impressions from the Henry case. Now who do we remember who got caught in bloody size eights? I think we have our bird. I'll be honest. Okay, if you're finished jawing, This is looking pretty moving. goddamn open and shut. I mean, <laughs> I can't believe we're still here doing 
I mean, to be fair, I have a sinking suspicion it might be the daughter. Like, we're gonna go down and track down where the rope came from, and it's like, well, like oh! Registered to their daughter! It came from your car! The fuck? You know? What are we doing here? What are we doing? You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Down to the high school. Fine. Where are we headed? Throw it. Stow it. Don't throw it. Rusty, I like it when you drive, because I'm lazy. Even though it's technically against the lottery. Yeah, she knows the hustle. Carruthers is a good man. Professional. Diligent. If you're working with a pro, it's easy to overlook the grim realities of a place like that. Funny job, that corner. Sure is. Hilarious. You don't want them to join their work too much. The wrong kind of man can get off and long and ram around a joint full of sports. Rusty, that's like something out of the pulse. You've been reading the same ones as The Penny Dreadfalls, if you would. You drunk to get through it. If I close one eye, swing, <laughs> just about make out the point. Not even denying it. Listen, Larson. I might be a little strong right now, but he did it. You know he's good at squinting with one eye. Got a seat to the bottom of the bottle. Is there anything left in there? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. This is the car? Yes, sir, detective. Have you looked it over? Superficially. I was told to wait for you guys. Thanks. You would have we'll fucked it, it up if you did. What time did you see the person park the car? Late last night, after school social, maybe 1 a.m. I've been mean, keeping a good eye out lately. We've had problems with the child molester. And this was the same man? You mean everyone know, we've met I'd on like a case yes, but truth that is, we've let go? Right. Tell me about this man you've been having trouble with. Listen, we're out he here solving real, real crime. crime. Yeah. yeah. He was around here last <sighs> night before the dance. Is he violent? Yes, sir, so, I would who say the fuck so. is that? Yeah. I'm like, high school it's in the 40s. <laughs> there you go. Hey, you. Get, Get that fucking child molester. Now please let me pull my gun button out. No, man, you need to talk to that guy. Oh, no, you don't mean a child molester. You mean a carjacker, because we can't put him in jail. Yeah, good hurdle. You hear if, that? If he's a child molester, that's Theme crazy. of kid touching. L.A. Noir theme of kid touching. I, I think this LP may have created the most disturbing sequence of sound bites from us ever. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> I don't know, the giving chi children pornography in, in Oh yeah. Yakuza is a Gotta give those kids too. the porn they need. I bought some child pornography. I bought a child some How pornography! You? Yes, it's a very specific way you need to say that shit. Being a man is very hard. It's, it's very difficult. It's such a divine struggle. Oh, you getting man. tired? Waste your day touching the kitties? <laughs> you Expend all your energy? Oh, little... Who's up? I'm sad I couldn't have done it closer to the fence Listen, so you'd go through it. What's your name? Who's asking? We can do this the easy way, or the hard way. Name's Eli Rooney. You've been in trouble with the law before, Eli? Some. What are you doing around here? <laughs> I like to keep an eye on the children. Strictly paternal, is it, Eli? Don't sass me, boy. A woman was abducted here last night, Eli, and murdered. And I would love to make you for that, you oaky motherfucker. <laughs> but I wouldn't know nothing about that. A woman, you say? I like him a little younger than that. Why are you, why are you pockets, talking? Because like, a cop is in this manner. Because it ain't a crime yet. Oh, because he, he because he knows he'll get super away with it. I was just standing in the wrong place. <laughs> oh, I found this arrest, butterfly Eli. out of near the Dairy Queen. Trouble. Eli. Wow. Okay. It's ugly. So if you hadn't learned about the brooch, this would have been nothing. You would he you would have probably had to let him go. I with the paperwork, Eli. I'm gonna take out my gun <laughs> and I'm gonna count to five. Let's see how fast you can run now. Hang on a god dang minute. I found that thing in the parking lot. Get some backup out there. <laughs> 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 he it! He was gonna do it! He I'll tell them we got a kitty raper coming in. They can roll out the red car. Holy shit! <laughs> he pulled it out! And Phelps like, Rusty, calm down. Rusty... Oh my god. That could've been worse. He could've, like, taken the gun from Rusty and emptied out all the bullets. Like, it was loaded! Safety off. What safety? I go into your car, I guess. It's behind you. We're not. We're not gonna. We're not gonna investigate the car that we came to is, investigate. Is there anything? There has to be. Oh! 
Yeah, I, well then. There, there was nothing in here, Wooly. Just leave. Yeah, it seems clean. Let's get out of here. Skedaddle. Blood and skin samples. We better get Ray Pinker out here. <laughs> yeah, dude, move it around a little bit. It's like a wet noodle. Uh, this never happens to me, I swear. <laughs> <sighs> Awkward. <laughs> yeah, that's the music that plays! <laughs> oh, jeez, just give me a second. There we go! Chrysler. Could be important. Yeah, it might be. Told you. A lot of tire iron damage going on. Tire it's iron. the weapon of choice. It is. Well, it's because everyone has one. Weapon of choice. The overalls are stenciled HM. Hmm, that must stand for, uh, Herman Munster. Herman Munster? Munster, this was going for. Close. Hugo Muller, does this belong to you? No, no, no. I think you need to call Central, get some people down here. It'd be pretty awesome if, like, the, the suspect could hear the music playing. <laughs> oh god, he found all the evidence! It's like, okay, I commit, I can, I can, I give up, I'm giving it up. I gave up. Oh, god, this, is that you? This way, Cole, my son. Behold. Continually let child molestacers go. Jesus, molestators. That, that was a I word. also didn't sleep. Man! There's a lot of kid touching going on in this game. Way more than zero. Well, you're in LA, oh, so yeah. No, am I throwing shade on the wonderful people of Los Angeles? Suspects being held yes. In the Seeing the West case. Coast likes them young? Yes. Certainly well, because they're in the past, so they need it younger. Thanks for your help. You know, I was going to leave it to L.A., and then you decided to upgrade my shade throw to the entire West Coast. You know, when you move to L.A., when they break legal, they turn legal three hours before. Why don't we go to the central station? You're behind the wheel. And where exactly are we going? You can't. It's awful. <laughs> can't. You can't. Hey, oh. You can't wait. No. You go where the time no. zones give you no. a little... <laughs> ah. Oh gosh! This is nice to make Rooney for this. I think we should lay it on him. He was near the car. He had her. So all of a sudden, him. even if he did it's not the it, husband, who cares whether he did it? You have kids, Phil. It needs to be taken permanently out of harm. Well, it's a good thing Rusty wasn't around for all those other cases where you let child uh, molesters go. Okay, so you're more than just a loose cannon. You're a piece of shit. Okay, it's like, oh no, yeah, yeah, yeah. put him on it. Put it on him. What about the real killer? Who cares if he did it? <laughs> You're a piece of shit. That's that and and point for now. Wrap wrap it up. Why can't we arrest and the also the only for a separate thing the, uh, and solve the murder as well, he Rusty? Should, he should be behind a desk. That's he is. So here's a new mechanic, Wooly. This is very important. It's Rusty. The, your your objective is to charge a suspect with a murder. Ready. You can interview in both, the but then you get to pick get who to put it on. Conviction. Yeah. So, which suspect do you like more in terms of that they did the crime? Yeah. You really come through this time, haven't you, Captain? Yes. Uh, we were on our way to interview Eli Rooney. Yes, folks, I know. This particular fiend is an old acquaintance. Oh. I have tried to reaffirm his belief in a wrathful and terrible God. Whichever way it goes. I'll be dealing personally with him. Oh my god, this guy has a cross <laughs> punisher. <laughs> he's like Wolfwood, I swear to god he's and, not And, and Willie, the, the way where it's not like go in and you're you're pinning the guy on whoever you interview. It's like it is a separate decision. So interview who you want. Interview both. Okay. And then make your pick. And then when the game gives you the end of case thing, CBS it'll be like, you yeah, you fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> you notice he's a little, he's a little beat up. Seems like he had a rough, uh, rough. So time. if you don't get to, the, if you fail that chase, you end up having to have a fist fight with him, and that's why he's beat up. Okay. But if you don't, yeah. you show up, and the captain's like examining his yeah, hands, yeah, and you're yeah. like, because he's gonna be beat up no matter mm. what. Tripped on your way inside the room there, uh, Eli. Multiple times even. Yeah. Floor out here is real, real, real shaky. Yeah, very knuckly. And all the new shit, and that's pretty much it. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. What size boot do you wear, Eli? Kind of like anything I can get my hands on. I'm wearing 11s. 
Sure. Okay, looks like he's still talking. But if you could choose what size Nope. Eleven. Can't you just look at his foot? I don't get yeah. that. Yeah. No. I have to. Oh, you don't have any evidence for his particular shoes, and why you can't ask him to just put his feet up? I don't know. Okay. Um, but he is in fact wearing Elevens. Okay. You down on your luck, Eli? I have worse. <laughs> Family a road kill during the Dust Bowl. But you have a job. A parolee has to have a job, correct? I had me a job down in San Pedro. I'm looking for something new. This place you worked have a name? Hennessy Marine. You can't miss place. Big yellow letters HM out front. Huh. They give you any workwear, Eli? Sure. Green coverall. <sighs> Dang thing was hot. Felt like I was back in the pen wearing it. <sighs> hey, look at that. <laughs> Fuck. So th <laughs> things aren't as uh, cut and paste as you thought. You ever tie up any of your victims, Eli? It's not a nice thing to go calling them. What would you call them? I can't say. I learned a long time ago not to go talk about the things I like. Talking about it just seems to get people's dander up. Answer the goddamn question, Rudy, before <laughs> I brain you. See what I mean? Short answer is yes. You have any preference regarding rope, Eli? I know a good rope from a bad rope, if that's what you mean. That's not what you mean, is it? Any old rope will do me fine. Don't fall around. Are you there? Hmm. And that would be from, you can get that at a church, or a marina, or a marina which he said he worked at, so. Try the lie, see what he says. You're lying, Eli. You're a creature of habit. You just get out of jail and you're back to your old ways. You use a specific type of rope. That may be the case. But you got nothing that says I used a rope to hurt that woman. Hmm. Oh, now it's just proving the ex like that a rope was used. Period. Maybe. What's rope pattern say? Rope pattern. Did you know, Mr. Mm. It's the rope that you can find at a church or a marina, and we have the actual rope itself, stained with blood. Uh, finding. I mean, okay, he doubts the accusation that I can prove rope was used, mm -hmm. and I think either of these. Would prove that well, it's not going to be either, it's going to be one of them. It, that you can't yeah, have multiples. Okay. What do you mean? How do you really? prove? Yeah, how do you prove that rope was used on her body yeah, by telling no, you? No, 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 no. The, the, the original chain of questioning is do you like a specific kind of rope? And the question chain is access like to a specific kind of rope. At, at which point, can you prove that he would use a specific kind of rope? That's correct. I've done 14 years in and out of prison, son. You think you can outweigh me? You're wrong. You're off the hook for now. Got to remember that. Let one. me look. Look at what he says here. Oh shit! You don't get that. No, you don't get it again. Yeah, no. The line. The line he said was, "You have nothing to prove. I used a rope to kill that woman." Is what he said. So it's so like it, it, that's more general. Yes, but the 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 more important is the initial frame of questioning is like, did you tie the, Do you tie them up? Do you use a specific kind of rope? And he says any rope will do me fine. And now you're arguing Looks as like to whether mistaken. or not he used a specific kind of rope in the murder. And currently you have nothing tying him directly. You could just use intuition. Yeah, you could. Really, truth. Wow. A boy like you, Eli, must prefer McGay for roping, am I right? I prefer braid, tie hitching braid, stays tied. Hmm. You killed Mrs. Muller and stole her jewelry. That ain't so. Ain't done nothing like that. Well, I mean, we found the- You're a liar, Eli. You needed the money, so you killed her. I've been around some. That which is bullshit because you got some evidence he, there's I money left in the purse. That woman. No way. No, I don't. I can just prove that you had it. 
I can't prove that you Sorry. stole it. Sometimes you have you to shake the tree to see what falls out. <laughs> Come on, Eli. How else are you going to pay for yourself? I got me a pension from the first war. It ain't much, but it does pay some. I don't like you, Eli. <laughs> I think you're an evil man. I think you try to pass off your pain to other people. I can't make you for this case. But my consolation is that I don't think you will be out of prison for very long. You can count on it, shitbird. By the way, Eli, the captain and the hat squad would like to talk to you next. Any idea what they might want to talk about? Okay. My money, you go more the number one suspect. The evidence is just solid. Just have Rusty just, just go through the doors. That's fine. Well, I mean, he's too drunk to actually pay attention. I want to stop him with one Ask the captain for advice. California. Is that a just no. no, no. It's oh, just beat him there, boy. Oh. Like, is that a function? <laughs> Here's where we stand. Here, the car in the end. Your next door neighbor heard screaming coming from your house. You were burning your blood-stained shoes. You have no one who can confirm your whereabouts last night. Your daughter says you're a violent man. We have everything we need to send you to death row. And all you have to say for yourself is, I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill her. <laughs> Give me that lie test. I can prove it. The lie test that isn't valid in court? Yeah, but... Yeah. All you have to do is make your heart... Like, yeah, jump. It's, me, Hugo. it's hard to beat, but you can do it. If you believe it, if you believe what you say, you can beat it. Pat's beaten several to be Why where he is today. Shoes, Damn it, Hugo. Because I knew you'd never believe me. Okay, well... Try me. Are you gonna tell me what I wanna know? Or do we have to take it out of you in lumps? Give it your best shot. <laughs> I can take whatever you're throwing. Damn. You couldn't really take my sick tackle, could you? Do you know anything about ropes, Hugo? As much as the next man. I, I was a scout. I learned some more in the army. It'd be funny if Cole got all chummy chummy. He's like, oh, you're in the army too? Oh, man. Yeah, oh, army. wow, yeah. Cool. What was, your, what was your favorite part of the army? Mine was, like, killing people. <laughs> I loved it. I say use all your intuition because this, this case is tough. With rope, with uh, my bare hands, but mainly with wire. I learned a lot of things in the army, but I, I still didn't kill my wife. For argument's sake, what type of rope would you use? If I had to, I would use a triple braid. Less flex, easier to control. I see. I believe it is, in fact, triple braid. Is that a triple braid? I'm not super familiar on rope, but it, the fine one was a hot tons, yeah. and then the first one was single. It looked like it, but I don't know yeah. if that's the actual name that they applied. Your wife was beaten with a tire iron, Hugo. An appropriate choice of tool for a mechanic. I know nothing about any tire iron. Uh-huh. Okay, well, he looks super guilty, yeah. Hugo. You're going to have to come clean on this. You got no proof. We All right, that didn't really help. We found a bloody tire iron in your fucking wife's car, motherfucker. How about the tire iron? Your wife drove a Chevrolet, Hugo. What make of car do you drive? A Chrysler Airflow. So I guess that explains why the tire iron that killed your wife came from a Chrysler. Whoops. We found your wife's car. Someone parked it at the school late last night. Do you have anything to say about that? It wasn't me. That's all you got. Where do you keep your work clothes? I keep them at work in my locker. I like that framing with uh, Rusty in the mirror. Yeah, just working around, walking around. So that's why they, they give that other explanation as to what HM could mean. Because yeah. it's too on the nose for it to be Hugo Muller, so... And the husband... Well, the overalls were... Because you're asking him... Did you get? Did you Where put you your wife's car? He says I keep them at work in my locker, and that's all. That's the, that was the question. No, no. The, the question is, did you put the the, the car back? Yeah. Did, were you the one that parked the car in the uh, school parking lot? And he goes, no. 
And then he asked him about his work clothes. Oh, uh, fuck. Uh, I was. I guess the end of the sentence of, of the question was was what I was. The the, the woolly. The, when you're when you're looking at the questions, the description where it goes husband's alibi or mm -hmm. whatever. That's the primary thrust of what we're talking about. Yeah. Enough lies, Hugo. Your overalls put you at the scene of the crime last night. My overalls are in the laundry of my house. Are they, Hugo? Okay, but here's the thing. You could show this and he'll be like, those aren't mine. Well, yeah, you could. You unless, could. Unless I they just, are. Unless they are, but I don't even remember who did it in this case. Green I do. Blood stain with the initials HM found in the trunk of your wife's car. They can't be mine. Why, Hugo? Because if they were yours, they'd be in the incinerator, too? So you have to nail them to the wall to a certain degree to be able to charge them. <laughs> but, Willie, do you find it's weird that, like, you have all this evidence and this guy's like, I just didn't do it. No one else really does that up to this point. I know, but I think that the, the pedophile is meant to throw me for a loop here. I feel like the evidence mostly points to him, including a bloody fucking shoe. <laughs> because <laughs> what? That he's burning! Because what, all what? evidence like, is equally distributed between both guys. Like sure, the, the pedophile sure. has got the, the, the brute. But a bloody shoe size 8, that like, is burning. what do you fucking take from that that we have at the scene? That's the most obvious thing. <laughs> Shoot prints at this thing, size 8. Stomping. Here's the and then he's blood. burning them, and there's blood on them, and I'm sure they would have Then you hit her in the past. And I'm sure they could have checked her to see, checked it to yeah. see it's her blood. And you can't- Hugo Muller, I'm charging you with the murder of your wife. You'll be arraigned and taken before a grand jury. Book him, Rusty. With pleasure. Yeah. The shoe is too strong. If the All shoe right, fits- Wear it, girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think this is just a sad cutscene of him just having the door locked on him. You wanna make oh, a break oh. for it, son? I want you to make a break for it. That's what I would like. Place. I have Look at the guy freaking yeah. out in the back. I stood in front of a troop of reporters and made promises. Promises of swift and fearful retribution, and you bring me an armful of vagary and happenstance. You made the department look bad, lad. Oh. Do it again and your career as a policeman will come to an abrupt and ignominious end. Are you serious? You two are back yeah. in the streets. Find street criminals, rouse them, beat them, and restore some fervor to your police work. I think you have to get all the questions the like perfect, maybe? next case will come you've revived my faith in your abilities. Now get out of here! What the fuck just happened? How is that a bad job? I don't understand. I think you must have had to get all the all the questions perfect. On I got each the per guy. I got the perfect I got the questions perfect with him on the first try. Yes. I fucked up no. one of the daughters. No, no. And then the, these two second time no, around. No, these two investigations. I think you got one wrong on both. I think they had to be perfect. That's just my guess. Oh, that's for for so the weird. captain to not be angry. I guess Pat's reading about it, but I I don't get what the fuck that was. Captain wants you to charge Eli. That's it. Everybody's happy with you if you charge Rooney. But that's not the truth. Look at the case notes! Hugo Muller stares down a murder charge. Michelle Muller contemplates life as an orphan. Good job, monster! Everyone wants that, but does that mean it's the truth? No. I guess oh. we'll never know. Life is hard. Hey, back to the war! The, 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 the country was doing great then. We captured two regular army. Lieutenant! Well, we've been over this. That sniper barely missed you back on the beach. Until the mission is over, there'll be no more saluting or signs of rank. I'm in charge here, Medier. Do you wish to interrogate the prisoners? Oh, well, they're beat. Why they look so sullen. You're wondering why we haven't killed them yet. There's no greater shame than being taken prisoner. Get this golden boy, I just seem to know what he's doing. Not to got the no kai so talk. Not my all. No, not to cut the eye on G on the Ibutai See that boys? He slapped that Jap right upside the head. It was merely to remind him of his place. His shame was the tone of voice that he used with a superior. I respect the Japanese, Corporal. Respect, we're here to kill the sons of bitches. Do you know why we are fighting the Japanese, Private? With respect, sir, these bastards attacked Pearl Harbor. And why did they attack Pearl, Private? Because they hate the U.S. of A and our way of life. They attacked the U.S. because we cut off their oil. 
What would we do if another country denied us the gas to run our cars? It's funny how he did the literal slapping of a Japanese man. <laughs> but was it for war pawns? He didn't punch him. He didn't kick him. We don't want to talk about all those cut things from that one Captain America video. Ah, <laughs> oh, Phelps. I was just discussing with You did Kimbar such a great well job on that last did case. You like the uppercase begin and never mind. Yeah, my real name. And you can just forget all about it. You boys have a new case. A poor Hispanic woman murdered near City Hall and left lying naked in an alleyway. Do any men get killed? Another naked woman, sir? Yes. We seem and to have had every woman's naked. Seems suspicious. Well, young Phelps, you win some and you lose some in police. That's the worst attitude to take on police case, work. Over the moon, boys. The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence, the witness, and the lack of an alibi. Now, get out there and catch me another tonight. So then you're not mad. No, it just doesn't take into account what you did last time. No, it does. That was so weird. But Mueller went through the courts, so he's happy. God, okay. he wants his clearances. Man. So then stop your impulsive assness for a little bit. When I when when I think I'm doing a good job here. No, he has to give you contrasting views. I took shit for nothing. You took now. shit because that's your job. Yeah. It's you your job to take shit. The alley off the Liso between Los Angeles and Alameda. You're kidding. The next one will be opposite Central Station. You count yourself lucky, fellas. Most guys would kill to land a case so close to their desk. Yeah. It means they can pop in to hit the office supply of hooch whenever they need it. Oh, that ain't a bad idea. That is Just not rolls a bad right idea off him. Nothing. We need to start calling. He's got super armor. We need to start calling it hooch again. Oh yeah. Yeah. I think some people still do. You're hitting the grandpa there, maybe. Kowalski. Oh yeah, grandpa. You know it, sir. Grandpas are still hard drinking. I. That's. But that's. I'm answering that's your question about people show. who do say I'll that. Take you through. 